Hey everybody, this is Joe over at Synergy17 and uh, today I'm going to show you a little uh, macro that I created um, just recently. Maybe it'll help you guys out. Uh, we call it the S17 mockup macro and what it's going to do, it's going to help you create your mockups a little faster. So um, we get started by making some uh, simple shapes here. I'll show you how it works. So I'm going to make a heart I'll just doesn't matter what color I make it, just so you guys can see it. And G17, and I'm gonna make that a certain font. Let's make it a rhinestone font. So this right here is a different macro we have called the rhinestone resizer. I'm just gonna use it real quick to resize these stones to some SS10s. Okay. Oh, I just wanted to resize that just so I have it um, just the right size for SS10s, which is 0.127. So here's what I want to show you. If we took this and put it here, and took the heart and put it here, that's just what it looks like. Well, you can show someone that, and that's perfectly fine. But if you want it to look more realistic, what we want to do is we're going to want to... Um, we're going to want to make it look realistic, like for example, like glitter or, or actual rhinestones. So, what we've created here is a mock up crater. Really, really simple to use. So, we have glitter, foil, rhinestones, and lens flares. Um, what you want to do is let's say we want this to be aqua glitter right here. This is the exact same one. We can click on it and then we could say apply and it asks you wh which object you want to do. You, you just use a little pin dropper or the little eyedropper and choose the one you want and all of a sudden now you have glitter. Okay, that was pretty easy. Um, let's say you wanted to do foil. Let me undo that. You would just go down here, choose a foil, choose gold foil or whatever you want, hit apply. Mm -hmm. It says choose object to apply foil to. You do that and now you have a foil looking um, design. So it's really, you know, whatever you want, you know, whatever you want to do if you want to do foils. There's a couple other ones I've been messing with. Um, let's say the yellow foil or actually let's see what orange foil looks like and uh, we'll try to add more if we can um, to these and uh, these folders are open you can add whatever uh, glitter textures you want or foils you want if you decide to create your own um, mm -hmm. so see that's more of like an orange foil there so it's kind of hard to recreate foils kind of kind of make a gradient to make it look like a foil but let's go back to the glitter okay well, that's just those two right there. So basically, those are uh, doing a power clip. Now we want to make the stones look realistic. So you go down here to rhinestones, choose whatever you want. Let's just do crystal clear. And you go to apply that. Let's say we want to apply it to this sphere. Say apply. Mm -hmm. It says choose a rhinestone to make realistic. I choose it with the eyedropper. And what you're going to see is it's going to replace all of them with these realistic stones. So all we have left to do now is to add some sparkle to it. So in here I put um, a few uh, lens flares that I, uh, we created. Uh, here's a white, here's some red ones, I think we have some blue ones in there but we'll just stick with white right now and I made, uh, there's two different small ones, two different mediums and two different larges. It doesn't really matter, you can pick the style you like. So we'll choose um, the small number one and you put the quantity that you want in here. If you don't, it'll tell you you need to know how many lens flares. So let's just say we want two of those. You hit apply. It tells you just click where you want the lens flares. So let's put one here. Put one here. Okay, those are small ones. We can go up here and choose uh, medium number. Let's do medium number two. Let's say we want three of those. Apply that. It says put them where you want them. Put one here, or we can put one here, or we can put one here. Um, maybe you want a large one. We can do uh, the large number two. Let's say we want two of those. Apply. Mm -hmm. Put one here and one here. So you can see how much better this looks now uh, with the realistic rhinestones, the um, lens flare, and the glitter uh, foil there. Or sorry, the glitter foil, the glitter. Uh, HTV. So anyways, 
It's really simple to use. You can apply a glitter, you can uh, change your rhinestones, and you can add lens flares. So basically that's it.